hello guys today we will be making an iOS 14 weather widget so make sure you have KWGT app installed on your phone so let's start by adding a KWGT widget on your home screen we're gonna make a square widget you might resize the widget according to your home screen app icon grid now tap on the empty widget tap this page icon and add a shape element by tapping this plus icon we're gonna make it bigger now we'll trim its corners we'll paint this widget a darker shade of blue now we'll move to fx and select texture here we will save vertical gradient and gradient color now we'll choose a lighter shade of blue to give this square element of a widget this kind of look this should look like this now we'll add a first text element tap the plus icon choose text and we're gonna add our location there you will find this current locality on the first example just remove everything from the formula editor and type this now we'll choose its font we are going to use San Francisco font we'll adjust its size and uh, we'll anchor it to top left and then adjust it, its position again Now we'll add current temperature, for this we'll add a text element and then tap on it and choose this WI or weather info and uh, first we'll remove everything from our formula editor space and then we'll choose the first option and we'll remove everything after that degree sign so that we do not have the unit. Now we'll change its font and its size, we're also once again using San Francisco font this time we're using San Francisco light and we'll anchor it to top left and reposition it now we're gonna be adding weather icons uh, I did not find any iOS looking icon pack set for KWGT so we're gonna use GNW download it from the Google Play and it will show up in the component section now we're gonna open it and scale it up then select its anchor we'll keeping it on center left and then we'll reposition it now we'll add another text element tap on the plus icon choose text and uh, swipe up tap on the text again choose the text field remove everything from formula editor now choose wi section again and select current weather condition tap done go back and uh, make it a little bigger set its font from the filter setting choose capitalize and tap ok now scale it up set its anchor to bottom left and uh, reposition it now we'll be adding a fourth text element this time we're gonna use the weather forecast so first of all we'll type h and uh, a colon and then we'll leave a space and we'll enter today's minimum temperature in local unit which is the first example you can see then we'll leave another space and we'll type L colon and a space and then we'll type in today's maximum temperature now we'll change the font of this text we'll be using San Francisco just once again then we'll adjust its size and we'll adjust its position don't forget to anchor it to bottom left
Finally, we'll add our last text element, which is the widget's name, weather. We'll type the weather and we'll put it right below the widget. Now save your work and you're done. I know this widget is not as accurately authentic as the original one and it won't change the background or it will change its mood to dark but it's just good because you've made it yourself. So if you like this video hit a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to see more such videos.